We're live. <laughs> yeah. oh. It's Thursday Thunder again. How many have we? How many of these have we done now? I don't know. We actually just one every week. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to know when we started. Yeah. Let's go look on the channel and see how many episodes there are. There'd be quite a few now. Close to a year almost. Must be. So we were doing it during my prep. Yeah. And I started about this time last year almost. Yeah. So it must be, it must be a year. Getting there. Getting there. Anyway, it's Thursday Thunder. Thursday Thunder. We had a busy morning. Yes, we've been out um, gallivanting all across town this morning. You can, probably can't see it because of the exposure, but we went to minus 110. We had uh, a cryotherapy session. Yeah. Yeah, which was um, pretty cool. It was different. It was cold. As it would be at minus one. Yeah, so what, what it is, we spoke about um, a couple of weeks ago on one of our other videos yep. where I went and visited them. But I was a bit crook, but we went back uh, this morning, so we had our full cryotherapy session. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to walk through like the experience. Yeah. Because it was, it was different. So we get there, it's a nice, nice little building, really cool. They've done it really nice. Yeah, the paintings yeah. on the walls, they really match the theme with the ice and the trees oh, and Yeah, stuff. exactly right, yeah. Then uh, we get given a bag of the clothing that we're allowed, that we're supposed to wear in there, and it's pretty, pretty funny. Uh, we've got a picture on your, on your phone. Yeah, yeah, we'll so Ariel we'll get Ariel there. put the picture up at, um, in the video here, as we talk about it. So that socks that go up to your knees, uh, gloves, but cotton, cotton gloves, still cotton. Yeah, yeah. woolen, yeah. woolen, woolen gloves. gloves. Um, a bandana to go around the ears, yep. uh, a mask, and then some cotton shorts, and some clogs, and then clogs. Awesome yeah. getup. Yeah. So it was a real fashion statement. But the whole idea was that we had four minutes in a three minutes. Well, four minutes all up. Oh yeah. In a, in a cryotherapy chamber. So the first minute or so, you were in conditioned into the first half of the chamber which was set at minus 40 degrees yep. to get your body ready and then you moved into the second part of the chamber which is at minus 110. Now when you're in there you can't see anything because there's what is it? What well is it's not steam, it was ice. Yeah. Was it nitrogen? Nitrogen steam rising up all around you. Yeah. Uh, and it is cold. Like it's it's cold. Yeah, nipples are like this. It's pretty bad. <laughs> so you're in there for three minutes. Now, I, the Philip outside was giving us a countdown, you know, two minutes to go, one minute to go, 30 seconds, etc. And when that 30 seconds call came, I was thinking, right, I'm ready to get out of here. Uh, it was getting pretty it cold. It was getting pretty cold. I mean, my legs were really cold. I was starting to develop that shivering, uncontrollable shivering. Mm. Yeah. But when you come out, and you come out into that warm room, it was really exhilarating, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. You almost slipped. Yes. <laughs> Mind your step. That's right. So the whole theory behind cryotherapy is, and you see athletes, you heard of ice baths, you see football players the next day um, going yeah. in the sea up to their waist. The idea is to bring, put your, immerse yourself in cold, brings the oxygen to the extremities of the body, thus promotes healing, speeds up your metabolism, there's lots of other benefits. Um, they reckon even with weight loss, with sleep. I took one of their sheets. So, so sports and fitness, it was uh, to reduce inflammation, swelling, and lactic acid, provides pain relief and pain elimination, promotes significant decrease in recovery time, which is good for bodybuilders, improves joint mobility, assists in regular uh, regulation of sleep behavior, which is what you get yeah. a little bit of trouble. Yeah. Assists in the elimination of harmful metabolic byproducts, improve muscle strength, helps reduce the effects of jet lag, accelerates muscle and soft tissue healing. Awesome. Uh, beauty and anti-aging. It's also good, also good for health and wellness. Yeah, loads of stuff. Just five minutes. Um, so we. It was interesting. Um, and cold. And it was cold. So you look them up on on Facebook. You've got minus one ten. They're, all, they're on uh, Hunt Street in the city. Um, I'm, what I'm looking forward to is to see tonight. If you sleep better. If you sleep better. Because everyone has said who does a session of cryotherapy that that night your sleep is just so much better. So uh, my sleep's not bad, but I'm a very restless sleep. I wake up very easy mm. and things like that. So um, I'm looking forward to seeing how I feel about that. 
but uh, it was good. Yeah. You know, the whole experience is pretty interesting. So if you are struggling with recovery especially, we've got a number of bodybuilders that are using it in Adelaide. They were talking to us. Asha Kulshar is doing that. She's using that as in her prep uh, for the Arnold Classic. Uh, I've seen her post and she she really raves about it, how her recovery has gone through, her sleep so much better. Mm -hmm. um, even having to uh, use her physiotherapy as much yeah. she has through in all other preps. So look them up, minus 110. They're on web and on Facebook. And uh, we'll let you know next week on how we yeah. pulled up and how we felt. You know? That's good. So with me, especially if, if I do find that it helps me not sleep, I might do one of these consecutive treatments for a few weeks. Mm. Just see how the body responds. But yeah, check out the photo. On the That's um, what's been going on in bodybuilding? We had the Baltimore Pro. The continuing theme of IFBB shows is continued. It's just about one every weekend now. I think this is one of the last ones. I think there's one more, and then there's a three or four week break between the yeah. So uh, the Baltimore Pro was on Victor Martinez came back from Kuwait. Um, he spent six weeks in Kuwait with the Camel Crew, which is a lot of what a lot of these guys are doing. And he came back, and in six weeks from his previous pro show, had changed phenomenally, and he dominated this show, won it easily. Akin Williams um, came in second. He's a big mass monster. This guy's going to make some um, name for himself in the future. And Max Charles third. Mm. Good guys. Good guys. So, um, Olympia is pretty well set now. I don't think there's many more people can, that, that can get in. There, there is one more show. What's interesting is that, um, oh, his name now escapes me. The little mass monster guy. No, they're all little mass monsters. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'll forget about that. Then I'll talk about it because their name is changing. Uh, but there's, I think there's one more show where people can uh, qualify. It's not like one episode. Of the no, no, no. There's one more show where they can qualify. Um, there was some more photos of Kevin Lebron came out this week. Yeah, yeah. Where he didn't look as good as in the other photo. Mm. So it's caused a lot of uh, discussion on what Kevin's going to be like. Mm. Um, they still got a, what, six weeks obviously? He's got six weeks, but yeah, I don't know, based on those photos, my, my stance has changed a little bit. We'll see. Well, he's always grown into it, so. That's right. Uh, anyway, what have we got? We've got some specials that are going on at Australian Muscle. So we've got some uh, Extend 30 serves, only 30 bucks. There's limited flavors, the stocks are getting really low. So uh, check out our website or uh, in-store. Uh, Max's Transformation Series, we've got a special on where you buy any product like their lean, uh, their mass, and you get a free night, 900 gram night time with it. Score. Yeah, so that's worth about 50 bucks. So any any transformation series in the Max's range, you get a free night time protein with it. Valued at 50 bucks. Now the Max's Challenge is also coming Max's up. Max's Challenge is starting there. Registrations are open now. Yep. It starts on August the 21st. Yeah, yep. there's already a fair few members here that are getting ready for it. That's right. So um, there'll be a whole new Max's range coming out uh, for um, the transformation uh, Maxis challenge, yep. and uh, we'll have those. There'll be special packs, Maxine's packs, Maxis packs, brand new ones for this challenge. Mm. So uh, they will be released in the next fortnight or so as the range comes in. Look it up. The challenge okay. is really good. Yeah, keeps you motivated. It's Twelve okay. weeks. It's a good, good um, something to set yourself up for summer. Yeah, especially now because it's going to finish. Uh, it'll finish right up um, in November. Yeah, that's yeah. perfect. So you'll be all set for summer. So remember the uh, adage that everyone says, which is true, the summer bodies are built now. So you have to start now. Yeah. So the Max's Challenge is a great opportunity to um, have some guidance. Get exactly right. Get into that. I think that's all we got. That's all we got. That's it. We'll let you know next week how we went um, with the cryotherapy. With the cryotherapy. Cool. Very interesting to let you know. See you guys. Stay humble, don't we know? See you later.